Hi there, it's Suzanne Doyle Ingram with you here and I've got a video for you today that's going to be really short and to the point but we're going to talk about how to research using Google. When you're researching a topic for writing that book this is what you're going to want to know. So what I'd like you to do is think about who your target market is and what words they use. So let's say for example uh, your target market is stay-at-home moms, okay? And you have a book that's about a topic that they would like. For example, you know, Home Organization for Stay-at-Home Moms by Jane Smith. All right, so when they sit down at their computer and they go to Google, what do they type into Google? They're not going to type in your name. They're not going to type in the name of your book. They're going to type in the words that they are using to express what they're looking for. So they might type in stay-at-home moms, you know, how to get organized or stay-at-home moms schedule, stay-at-home moms uh, house cleaning tips or I don't know, actually I'm not a stay-at-home mom, but um, you get my point. You really need to think not about yourself and your book and what you're all about. You need to think about your customer and what she or he is all about and what the words are that they type into Google. Then you want to make a list of those words. They're called keywords. You want to make a list of the words that she probably uses when she types in to Google. Now go ahead and take that list and type them into Google and see what comes up. You know, this. I know this is a bit time consuming and you might think, oh, I can't be bothered, I just want to write this book and get it over with, but spending time researching your topic is worth it. So make a list of keywords and then type them into Google and see what happens. You might think, oh, I didn't realize that if someone types in that word, they get all these different other things that have nothing to do with your topic. You might need to refine your keywords, okay? You can compare your searches in Google and Amazon. So let's say a keyword that you type into Google that you find, oh, that's a good one. Go to Amazon and see what comes up when you type it into Amazon. And if books come up that are on your topic, you know you're bang on and that sounds like it's going to be a good keyword for you. You can use your keyword in the title of your book. Ta-da! Because you'll notice when you're typing in that keyword into Amazon, the books that come up are about that word and have generally have that keyword either in the title or the subtitle or on the sales copy. So this is a quick tip for you today about keywords. I hope that you found it helpful. For more training, download your copy of Quick and Easy Kindle Profits on my website at SuzanneDoyleIngram.com. The link is below. If uh, if you need any help at all, uh, join me on Facebook. My Facebook name is Suzanne Doyle Ingram Biz. I look forward to seeing you over there as well. Take care and have a great day.